In this video, we will demonstrate how to install PowerShoot Business Edition using Smart UPSC or SMC 1500. Okay, so uh, I have here now is the uh, USB cable that we're going to be using. This one is a USB A to a USB A, and it has it has a part number of 940-0505 printed on one side of the USB connector. Actually, it's on both sides of the USB connector. And then we will be connecting this one or this cable to the back uh, USB port of the UPS system. Okay. And the other end will go to the USB port of my PC. I will now show you how to download and install PowerShoot Business Edition 9.5. Open up your browser, go to www.apc.com and then on the search box type in PowerShoot Business Edition. Click on download. Select the operating system. I'm using Windows 10. I click on download. Click on download now. Once the download is complete, you may launch the executable file. Okay, I have the executable file downloaded. I will launch it. Click Setup. Click Next. You may check on the uh, license agreement. After that, you may click on yes. Click next to use the default uh, destination folder. You may also uh, customize this, but on this one, we'll use the default. Click next. Would you like to automatically search all communication ports for a UPS? I will click no on this one. I will choose SMC, which is the model of our UPS, and I will just leave this on, no connected to the USB port or UPS port. Click next. Since we are using a USB cable, I would uh, select USB. Click next, click OK. For this one, for the username, I will be using APC UPS for example the password should comply with the requirement here down below it says one upper and lower case letter one number or special character minimum eight characters in length I'll be using this one for this example
I will click yes and click finish. I will close this one just to click cancel and then I will launch the Parshoot Business Edition web interface. Okay, on this one, you see this, click on more information and click on go on to the web page. It will now ask you for the username. So put in username you assigned earlier and a password. Okay, so after you've typed in the credentials, this is the window that we're going to be expecting. Okay. It is the initial setup window of PowerShoot Business Edition. Click Next. You can just uh, click Next here as well. You can leave uh, those settings uh, in default and you can just uh, change those settings uh, late at the later time. Click finish and now you will see the uh, the interface of PowerShoot Business Edition showing you the status of the UPS which is a smart UPS 1500 currently device status UPS is off. Okay. Thank you for watching.